What to do what it is, it's your party chef here, aka Drunk Wizard, aka Mr. Know It All, aka your favorite YouTuber's favorite YouTuber, aka we're still in jail. Yo, the goat and the baby goat. Bah. Wait, that's sheep. What do goat noises make? Lacey, what are goat's noises? What are goat noises? Goat, goat. I think that's just what goat noises are. This is gonna be the uh, NFC East. <sighs> My fucking Giants, man. Now, I know anyone that's gonna be new to the channel, don't be thinking, ooh, crazy. I'm not one of those delusional fucking Giants fans that think we're making the playoffs, but I digress. We still got a little hand left in this one, and in case we run out, I brought out the reserve bottle. Hand on, hand on. Woo! It's still smoking. You probably can't see it, but that's some hot shit. Alright, we'll take a shot. We'll get right into the video. I want to say thank you guys. Love you guys. Appreciate everyone for all their support. So many people have been stepping up. So thank you. Alright, where to start? Where to start? Where to start? Where to start? I guess I'll start with my Giants. So, I got notes here. I got my trusty dusty notebook. My trusty dusty beautiful pink notebook. Don't make fun of me. Fuck yo. New coaching staff. New offensive coordinator. New defensive coordinator. New everything. No preseason. Pandemic. Fucking... <laughs> And the quarterback we traded for is about to get kicked up out of kicked out of the league. Good job, Gettleman. Good fucking job. Don't take fucking greedy like Ernie wanted, cause I'm a fucking spot. Dear New York Giants, Ernie Shafter could be your GM. I'm I'm almost as fat as Gettleman, and I'm smarter, and I'm way more attractive. Ernie for Giants GM 2021. Let's get that going. We're a bit of a mess, man. No DeAndre Baker that we traded up for. Uh, I liked I, I I liked our draft. I thought I, I liked our draft. I liked our draft. I wanted Simmons, but now a soldier uh, sitting out. I mean, it really makes sense. Look, man. Anyone in this shit is fucked up right now. I won't hold it against any player if they're like, "Look, I'm out." I think the real question for the Giants is, what is the progression of Daniel Jones going to be? Baby Eli. What is Baby Eli going to be? Can Saquon Barkley stay healthy? Can our wide receivers stay healthy? What's going on with our defense? We made some huge, huge, huge additions with uh, Blake Martinez from Green Bay Tackling Monster. We got Bradbury back in the secondary. I mean, our schedule's pretty tough. I just, after years and years of having a lot of faith in my Giants, I just can't do it anymore. Like, I say we get five wins. I feel like five wins. What? If it was a normal season, six to seven wins was feasible. But considering everything, I love Joe Judge. I, I, I know I'm going to end up regretting this, but. <laughs> I love Joe Judge. All right, Baby Coughlin. So we got Baby Coughlin. We got Baby Eli. We'll see how it goes. Uh, fuck Saquon Barkley, but that's what it is. I wish I had a pen. All right, let me get my pen here so I can check them off as I go. So 5-11 and 11 for the Giants. All right, well, that pen's out of ink. 5-11 and 11 for the Giants. Let's move on to Washington because I feel like that's the easiest team to talk about because they're a fucking dumpster fire. Like, let if since we're being honest, Washington has no chance of not doing shit. Never, ever, ever, ever. They got no, literally no fucking team. <laughs> Washington has no team name. Uh, their star running back just they can never stay healthy. Uh, is locked up for choking the shit out of his girlfriend. 
<laughs> Fucking Washington, right? What can he do? I do love Ron Rivera. I do. I do. I won't lie. I love Ron Rivera. I didn't even make notes on Washington because you really don't have to. I do like their defense. Uh, they had an okay draft. They had an okay draft. Not horrible. Not great. You gotta like Chase Young. But I got, I got, I got, I got four, four and 12. Four and 12. Also, remember that I don't believe this season will conclude. So there's that. I have no faith. The NFL plays all 16 games. None. None at all. So, now we get down to Dallas. <laughs> Shit. Here we go. I can just see Mark and all the fucking Lacey. I don't think Rain not getting his contract is going to bother him at all too much. Uh... Losing their center. At first, I didn't love their draft. I'm not going to lie. But I think it ended up being one of the most complete drafts in football. So, I can't hate on their draft. They lost some really key pieces. What did they do to make it up? People are telling me. But I do like Love McCarthy as that coach. Just feels like there's a lot going on in Dallas. Make sure I miss nothing. Yo, their schedule is fucked up. For a team that didn't win the division, Dallas's fucking schedule is fucked up. Yo, they need Jesus. They absolutely need Jesus. Their schedule is fucked. I don't know how they got such a shitty schedule. I have Cowboys fans telling me all the time that their schedule is gravy. They must not know how to fucking read. <laughs> Woo. Woo. Oh, boy. All right, we're good. Mm. When that hen dog hits. Focus, son, focus. Ugh. I just lose some Byron Jones in the secondary that is already questionable. They're a sack leader. It's been a stressful day. Sink egg! Now, my regulars on the page will laugh at me, and this is when they'll say Saint Gang. But it's been a stressful fucking day. So don't hold this against me. To the new people. He's like, this motherfucker can't hold his liquor. Ho ho ho! Wait till I come back on YouTube. Then come find me. Watch. Oh, Dallas. I wanted to go 8-8. Eight and eight. I just couldn't do it. I just, Dallas finds a way to win nine games. I just think Rain will be extra motivated. Even though I'm super worried about the center position, I, I still think Rain is going to be super motivated. So, I say 
Dallas has a really good shot at wild card, especially since the wild card expanded to two teams this year. So I would say rain, rain and the Cowboys. Really, really, really good shot at the wild card. Nine and seven. So we have nine and seven for the Cowboys. We have five and eleven. For the New York Football Giants, and we have four and twelve for the Washington team. The I know I said I was not doing another shot, but I got to. These motherfuckers named their team the Washington team. All right, stomach's on track now. Now we good. Let me clear my throat. Da -na 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 -na. Which brings us to the Eagles. Are you gonna stop hating on Carson Wentz? God damn it! Stop. S T O P S. I don't know sign language. S T O P. Stop. I hate it. He's always hurt. Stop! You're stupid! You sound stupid! You all sound fucking stupid! That's coming from a Giants fan! You sound stupid! Go dumb dumb! Go dumb dumb! Go stupid! Go stupid! Uh, they had a weird fucking draft. Didn't love their first two picks. They tightened it up from picks three on. Their first two picks were like, okay, guess we're gonna be stupid today. That makes sense. Very weird draft for them. You'd think in a team that uh, had so many depth issues last year and is really like, has a quarterback who I really love. I think he's a top five arm talent. Like, he's a top five talent in the league at quarterback. That's undisputable. I mean, he dragged that shitty Philly team to the playoffs last year. Fucking dragged him. Threw him over his shoulder like a continental soldier. You know what I mean? So, they picked up Darius Slay. Huge, huge addition. Uh, questions about their offensive line. They just brought back Vinny Curry for uh, on a one-year deal. Tough schedule. Tough, tough schedule. I wanted to give them 11-5. I decided to end it at 10-6. and six. I feel like 10 and 6 is pretty reasonable, pretty rational. You know, 10 and 6 seems like about where it should be. So, remember, guys, always, we're doing a live premiere on this video. I, comments, feedback, like, comment, share, subscribe, PayPal, Super Chat. Probably said some more of that shit in the beginning, but my stomach wasn't cooperating. Shit, now all of a sudden I got a lead stomach and I'm ready to go and it's the end of the fucking video. All right, man, I love you guys. Thank you, everyone who's been keeping me afloat during my lockup. Fat Casper Mafia! Oh, shit. Keep an eye out. Sunday, for we're doing a mystery box on opening of baseball, uh, autographed baseball cards. Well, ooh, Thursday. I'll also drop a uh, some unboxings. So be on the lookout. Back house for Mafia! Puff Gang! Pew, 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 pew! Skirt, skirt! Love you, motherfuckers!